first thing, my name is, uh, what is my name? Ryan Parati. Um, and I have uh, the pleasure of introducing these people on stage. And the reason why um, I'm standing down here without any lights, because uh, I think this is how I'm going to do it from now on, because really this is, this is a lot of what happens during class. I am not the person a lot of times that works the, 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 uh, the songs with them. I, I'm kind of on the, in the background, they do a lot of stuff, and then I come in and fix these things and little things, and then I step back again, and, and that's what I do. Um, these guys run all of this on their own. They do everything from the auditions for the solos uh, to um, coming up with most of the song choices. I, I kind of squeeze one or two into my own, um, especially if I write the arrangement of it. It's like, well, you have to do it now. Um, but that's why I'm here. I'm also not, you know, dressed like la the other night, uh, you know, because I'm, I'm kind of one of you guys expect, uh, you know, being a spectator of these uh, wonderful uh, students of mine. Um, but we have a couple things to go over real quick. Uh, just first of all, um, the choir banquet is coming up. You've probably heard of the choir banquet, and you might go, well, my kids are in room 100. They're not in the choir. It's for all students in all the choirs, including room 100. So I want you to, to be invited to that. Mrs. Corbel, uh, Rochelle is somewhere. She's going to be uh, out in the lobby afterward, afterward to um, if you have any questions about that, but it's on May 31st. It's from 6.30 to 9.30 uh, at Bellicera. Um, so it's going to be an awesome time. Uh, we did it about three or four years ago, and I just uh, really enjoy that time. Um, the orchestra is tomorrow. They are performing tomorrow. The Wind Symphony is performing on Monday, and the jazz band is performing on Tuesday. So I'd love to see you. This is great. I love this crowd. I mean, this is, this is I think, more than, than we've had in the past for, for an acapella group, so that's great. I'm super excited about it. We have some alumni that came back. If you're an alumni uh, of Room 100, go ahead and stand up. If you're an alumni of Room 100, go ahead. I know there's a couple of you here. Yeah, they're all there. Yeah. Zeke All right. There you go. So some of you didn't come see me earlier when I looked at you. Um, but that's OK. I don't, I don't hold grudges. Um, so uh, the so the next thing is um, pending board approval. This is kind of a newer announcement. Um, we have a trip for all of you that are going to be here next year from February 14th through the 18th. It's going to be during President's Day weekend down to Disney World, okay? And it's going to be, we're going to have some performances and all kind of uh, great stuff. I know the, the marching band and the choirs and Room 100 and all, it's going to be an incredible uh, time. So mark your calendars. We'll have more information after the June board meeting. Um, we're going to put it on there and hopefully it'll get approved and we'll have more information after that. So now I want to talk about these guys. Uh, the Kettering Acapella Festival is a nationwide acapella festival. They, um, they audition in September. I think it was September 29th. We had to have our film in. Um, they, do people call it film anymore? I don't know. Um, but we put it, we actually put that, put it in for, you know, that uh, a specific time period, which is, of course, they've been like practicing for, what, three or four weeks. And... We ended up becoming one of seven in the world to perform at the showcase at Kettering. Now, that sounds really impressive, but we've done that three times, which is even more impressive. Uh, this group has been amazing throughout. So the alumni that are here have probably been a part of, the, of one of those. It, it, and it's just um, it's an amazing uh, festival. We, we love it. Uh, so that's they did that. Then we went to... Orlando for the National Acapella Convention. And guess what? They made the showcase for that too. So these guys have done some amazing things. Yes. And I don't want to talk about this next thing. Thank you. The, I don't want to talk about this next thing uh, too much because they're going to be talking about it on stage. But they also did release their first single. And um, I will just leave it at that because I know um, uh, one of them is going to be talking to you about it. So that's really all I have, and that's all you're going to hear from me. These guys, are you guys ready to hear this group? Okay.
But before we go on, I, I don't like that applause. I want this thunderous applause. Can you do that for me? Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> now, if you hear that, if you hear something you like, if you hear some high note or some low note or some beatboxing or something in the middle and it excites you and you're like, yeah, that's great, don't be afraid to do that in the middle of the song. It's okay. It really is okay to do that, okay? So that's what we, we encourage. All right. Are you ready? All right. Here we go. In September of 2016, Peters Township High School created a new class called Acapella Adrenaline. A month later, the group changed its name to Room 100. In the past seven years, they have performed at places such as the Kettering Acapella Festival, the main stage at City Walk Universal Studios Florida, and their newest endeavor, the National Acapella Convention in Orlando, Florida. Their unique sound is a combination of R&B, pop, jazz, and rock. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Room 100! Love was changing the minds of pretenders While chasing the clouds away Our hearts were ringing in the key that our souls were singing As we danced through the night Remember how we knew love was here Never was a cloudy day. Never was a cloudy 
Hey guys. Thank you guys so much for coming to, you might think, our last Room 100 concert. I'm Michaela, I sing mezzo. And I'm Britton, I sing alto too. And uh, amazing job to our soloists, Connor McElhaney and Sarah Collins on September. <laughs> and wow, isn't this a lovely crowd? It is. Yeah. You know, our next song's pretty lovely too. I think so too. With soloists Grace Trax? And Anthony Luisi? Yeah. Please welcome. welcome. Isn't she, she lovely? lovely. in the park, strolling the summer days of imaginings in my head, and words from the heart, falling into the wind, found even without being said, and I don't want to bore you with my trouble, cause there's something about your love, it makes me weak and it knocks me off my feet, cause there's something about your love. Hello. Sorry, I had to grab my notes. Um, I'm Tess. I'm so thankful that you are all joining us today. Um, for our next piece, we're going to stay in the 70s, and we will be performing Don't Stop Me Now, originally performed by Queen. And for this song, we have another fabulous soloist, um, Michaela Bear. Please enjoy. <laughs> Tonight I'm gonna have myself a real good time. I 
Hi, everyone. <laughs> okay, I have had the absolute pleasure for the past two years to be able to run our social media for Room 100, so I'm here to talk to you guys for a little bit about that. Um, I have a request. I want you all to go on your phones right now, and if you can't, do this later, um, and go to your streaming service of choice, be it Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube, Pandora, whatever it is, and I want you guys to search you might think, but not by the cars, by Room 100, because we have dropped our first single, which is incredible, and we are very, very excited. So search it, favorite it, save it, like it, send it to your friends. Um, and with that news comes something else very exciting. We will actually be releasing a music video in the next couple of weeks. So <laughs> if you would like to see that, Give us a follow on Instagram at room 100 acapella. Shameless self-plug because I run it. Um, and I also have notes about our next song. So this song was released in 1984. We are done with the 70s. We are on to the 80s. And it was by The Cars. And it was later featured in the Disney movie by the same name. Um, and fun fact, their music video was one of the first ever to contain computer graphics. Ours will not contain computer graphics, but it'll be equally as cool, so make sure you uh, 
watch it whenever it comes out. And so, without further ado, this is You Might Think, arranged by no other than Mr. Parati, and <laughs> soloing Anthony Luisi and Emma Hardy. My name is Emma Hardy. <laughs> so our next song is from the 90s and was arranged actually by the boys in Room 100. So I just want to say a big thank you personally to everyone in this group and Mr. Parati. I'm going to miss this more than anything. I feel like, sorry, I feel like I've just, I've loved being in this group so much. And I feel like it has definitely made a huge change in my life. Our next song is Change in My Life. Thank you. But before that, a beatbox song.
will be here all week. <laughs> and get back up here, buddy. Before we move on, May 18th, today is Matt's birthday. 17, baby, woo! Thank you, thank you. 17, I've known this man for seven years and he is my, one of my best friends ever. So, since none of us actually any, know anything about singing, um, we were hoping that you guys could help us uh, sing happy birthday to him. So uh, here's your note. <laughs> Ready? A one, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Matt. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. 26 you, years old, Thank everyone. You. 26 years old. Love you too, Gordon. I've been misunderstood I've been washed up I've been put down And told I'm no good But with you I belong Cause you helped me be strong There's a change in my life Since you came along Oh, whoa Whoa, whoa, yeah No, I don't mind working so hard With you I remain I've been lonely, I've been cheated I've been misunderstood I've been washed up, I've been put down And told I'm no good But with you I belong Cause you helped me be strong There's a change in my life Since you came along Oh, whoa, whoa Life is all wrong And her heart gets weary Where it doesn't belong And a road gets rocky Lord, you got to keep on And a new life Will be shining on through I've been cheated, I've been misunderstood. Come on, I've been washed up, I've been put down, and told I'm no good. But with you, I belong, cause you helped me be strong. There's a change in my life since you came along. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. yeah.
So, uh, before we start here, being in room 100, it takes a lot of dedication and hard work, and you know, sometimes that dedication comes verbally, but other times it comes visually. But I'll finish that later. So, hi. Um, I met you guys before, how is, I mean, the night's going well, but before we get into our next song, I just wanted to say how lucky I am to be a part of this group. You guys really made my year, and I couldn't have really been so confident and get out of my skin as much as I have this year without them. And I also wanted to take this time to thank Mr. Parati for everything, so please give him a round of applause, because he's done so much for our group. <laughs> And now, relax. Let your hair down as we perform, as Emma Mihok sings, Put Your Records On. Don't need to work. Don't, don't worry. Summer came back to mind. So sweet. Little girls double dutch on the concrete. Mm -hmm. Maybe sometimes we got it wrong, but it's alright. The more things seem to change. Don't you hesitate, girl, put your records on, on. Tell me your favorite song. song. You go ahead, let your, your hair down. Sapphire oh. and faded jeans, I hope you get your dreams. Just go ahead, let your hair down. You're gonna find yourself somewhere, somehow. The sky, sunburnt and lonely, sipping tea in a bar by the roadside. Just relax, don't you let the hot boys fool you. Gotta love that curl your hair. As I was saying before, <laughs> <laughs> 
being in room 100, it takes a lot of dedication, and you know, sometimes that dedication comes from words, but other times it comes from pictures and the visual. So us at room 100, we'd like to recognize Mr. Parati with this uh, signifying <laughs> poster. That is tradition, we do it. We do, it, yeah, we do it every year. I mean, it's just, you know, there's no way of getting out of it. Uh, so uh, here we go. Yes, we also have Don K. Thank you very much. All right, now that that's uh, done with there. So the boys have done their song, so now it's time for the girls to do their song. The girls have chosen a song from 2016 that currently has well over 200 million streams on Spotify. Laying down some funky beats on vocal percussion is Caroline Padden and hitting those, <laughs> yep, that's right. Hitting those low bass notes is uh, Emma Hardy. Let's give her a hand up. Solo for this song is sung by none other than Francesca Zampetti. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Greedy by Ariana Grande and arranged by our very own Emma Mijo. Hi, I'm Grace. Um, 
I'm a senior and I'm singing alto one, and the next song we're going to be singing is called Karma. I'm not talking about the 11th track on Taylor Swift's 10th debut album, <laughs> Midnight's, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, this Karma was originally released by Years and Years and was arranged for acapella by the Nor'easters. We performed Karma at the Kettering National Acapella Festival and also at the National Acapella Convention. Um, <laughs> it's one of our favorites, so please enjoy, and it's featuring our soloist, Emma Hardy. Is there a dark before the dawn? Is this a problem or solution? No, I can't tell. My name is Francesca, I'm a senior, and I sing soprano one, and our next song is originally written and performed by my favorite singer, Harry Styles, um, and our soloist is our amazing choreographer, Tess Phillips. Almost all of the dances with the songs that you've seen today have been choreographed by her, so it's really amazing. She's so talented. <laughs> I love you guys. Um, we took this song to Kettering back in November and the audience really loved it, so I hope you guys do as well. And without any further ado, this is Late Night Talking. Baby, happy 
so far good yeah I'm surprised they're letting me back on the mic but here we go again so uh, I am actually this is my first year in room 100 so and this is actually my first year in any choir class so just to let all of you know anyone any younger people you can do really anything new that you would like so I really like music and I really like to sing and I'm like mr. Parati's pretty cool and I thought I'd try it so now I want to take a minute to recognize people like me and people who are, have amazing talent, the new members of Room 100 that are, be, are going to be singing for us next year. So if you're a new member of Room 100, please stand up so we can recognize you. You guys are wanna, gonna wanna come back next year because there's, there's some talent, let me tell you. We have some competition, but you, know, you, you guys will probably be okay, so you know. Um, all right, so the next song we're gonna sing uh, came out in 2018. It reached number five on the year-end Billboard Hot R&B chart in 2019 and has five, a five-time platinum rating in the US. At the beginning of the year, Mr. Parati had us pick some songs that we like to perform. Uh, and this song was recommended by me, but it was chosen by Room 100 as a whole. So get ready to take it slow, reminisce about love. Oh. And feel free to sway to the beat with a solo from Grace Tracks. <laughs> Sit back and enjoy Slow Dancing in the Dark by Joji, arranged by our very recent student teacher, Jacob Berger.
slow dancing in the dark Don't follow me, you'll end up in my arms You've made up your mind I don't need no more signs Can you? Can you? Give me reasons we should be complete you should be with him, I can't compete You looked at me like I was someone else Oh well, can't you see? I don't want to slow dance in the dark Um, I'm Britton Oglesby, but as Mr. Parati says, Britton Oglesby, and I'm never going to let him live that down because he's known me for three years and he still doesn't know how to pronounce my last name, but okay. So unfortunately, this is our last song. <laughs> I wish we had more too. This is my last song I'll ever perform with Room 100 and I'm really sad about it. <laughs> So thank you so much for everyone in Room 100 for making this one of the best years of my life and becoming some of my best friends. And thank you, Mr. Parati, for being you and doing all that you do for us. Yeah. Um, our final song is Should Have Been Us, which is originally sung by Tori Kelly and arranged by King Rob Dietz. And um, our soloist is Amelia Severin. So please enjoy and thank you so much for coming to the concert. We really appreciate it. Walk around my head down, but I can't hide with these high heels on. Downtown at the crowd, but it's just you that my mind is on. Dress up by my heart, mess up, you got yours and I got mine. It ain't fair that I still care and don't want to where you are tonight, thinking it could be different. But 
maybe we missed it Thinking it could be different It could, it could It shouldn't have been it Shouldn't have been a fire Shouldn't have been a perfect storm Shouldn't have been I tug of war, what's it all for? Do I want it back? Still got a little flame for ya Even though you drove me mad Now and then I'm pretend That it's you when I close my eyes You got yours, I got mine But I wonder where you are tonight Should've been at Should've been a fire Should've been a perfect storm It could, it could